Whoa there, Nobu. You were really ready for this adventure today, aren't you? Alrighty guys, my name is Jeep Time. Oh yeah. And today we're back with another episode of Ghost of Tsushima. I'm very excited to be back. Starting a new chapter of Ghost of Tsushima, like how I had said. And uh, in these new chapters, I guess uh, our little birdie friend is always here to help us out. So let's go ahead and see where he takes us this time. Uh, last episode, we had um, just gotten here to the new island. We'd seen uh, the real meat of the island, I guess you could say. And uh, we noticed all the destruction around that the Mongols have caused after their invasion uh, from the original island that was just right over here, uh, Izuhara. And they went over to Toyotama. And uh, they ruined everything again. So, uh, we're gonna, this place is very different that I've noticed. It's actually very, really pretty though. As, <clears throat> as much as it got destroyed, it is a nice little pace. It was probably much, much more beautiful beforehand, but, uh, I mean, look at this. Just these new, instead of the, the taller <clears throat> grasses with the uh, white tops, we got these that are like small little, look like, uh, til tulips or something. Oh, wait, those are the hot dog flowers with the little fluffy hot dogs inside. Apparently, if you eat those things, oh, I saw a video at least, if you eat those things, then they, uh, they expand weirdly. And, uh, you, well, obviously you're not supposed to eat those, but, I mean, people do it. People do whatever. <gasps> How dare you, Hutnobu. Oh. Wow. I wonder, oops, I did not mean to use a ku kunai on you, but I will kick you in the back. If not mistaken, this is for the spears, or, like, the thrust weapon, so... That should work, right? Can't believe you touched my Nobu. Now we ran away all scared. Look at him over there. Nobu, it's alright. Don't be afraid. You're here with me, Jin Sakai. So right now we're gonna be heading over to... Actually, we'll do- we'll help out with Kenji just cause Two of three, like, I can finish this, I can, we're passing right through it, may as well do it, but, um, like Yuna said, we have to broaden our horizons, and, uh, this is what this quest is, so we're gonna go and see if we can recruit anyone to help us out with, uh, this Mongol invasion that they've invaded two parts of this island, Sushi Shop, Shoka, wow, Tsushima Island, and I took over, um, Uncle's, Uncle Shimura's, uh, little castle. With the help from our dear friend, uh, Ryoza, which is a little sad, but that's alright, I guess. Wow, that is a lot of stuff to do. Man. <clears throat> um, I need to decide if... Oh. If I will be including all this side stuff into my videos, I feel like it'd be worth seeing everything. I just want to make sure to play the main game as much as possible first, just so we can uh, see the story first, and then afterwards we can do all the side stuff. Because 100%, this is one of those games where you gotta 100% it to really experience the full experience. I've heard, at least. Uh, I saw a small little article that I'd said uh, games you've never really played enough when you uh, or games you never really completely played <clears throat> uh, if you haven't 100 percented it and uh, this was definitely this was on there so was God of War which makes a lot of sense I know there's a tons <clears throat> of little extra things you can do that aren't part of this main storyline. So if you beat that, then you'll go straight to just 50, 
usually games have you do uh, the main storyline and I'll only be for 50% 50% of the darn game like wow that means a whole nother 50% of however much you did all over again just in side missions like wow and if you really like the game then you'd want to see it all of course all right let's go ahead and uh, help out Kenji Kenji what are you doing you have stumbled on a perfect opportunity, my lord. Down this road lies an enemy camp stuffed with supplies to feed, clothe, and heal dozens, hundreds, and the Mongols left. <laughs> it's a ripe plum just begging for it. What are you not telling me? This is a simple situation. No Mongols, lots of stuff. Help ourselves, help the people. <laughs> On the slim chance some good comes of this, lead the way. I knew you'd understand, Lord Sakai. Um, progress in your current tile will be saved. Yes. Nat Uo and the Sakai Cellar. Uh. Kenji it reminds me a lot of uh, Dobby for some reason, but like maybe like a little bit more of a less scared Dobby. How did you find this camp? I've been following these guys for a while. They're so arrogant they leave their camp unguarded when they go on raids. Then who are you waiting for on the road? Who? Who me? Uh, uh, nobody. Oh, I was on my way to the camp when you happened by. There are survivors taking refuge near the Yarikawa stronghold. They need supplies. That's exactly the people I'm trying to help. What did I tell you? So beautiful it makes you weep. Look around. Gather what you can. Uh, I feel like we're gonna get ambushed here, Genji. Uh, I don't know if you feel the same way, but uh... Yeah, let's talk man to man, man. I feel like we're gonna get ambushed here. But uh, let's continue on, I guess. Let's find some food, food, and, food and supplies. Fish, vegetables, rice, and millet. Japanese, not Mongolian. They're learning to like our cuisine. Clothing, leather, silk, wood. This can help a lot of people. I told you this was a good idea. Kenji, you sure this is a Mongol camp, right? Oh, okay. I mean, I hope so. Oh, look at that. Look at that ram. And some armor. Well, I wonder what would happen if Kenji was a samurai. Oh, hello. Kenji! I'll kill you! Who are you? The man who's going to end Kenji's life. You left me here to die. No, not true! I brought help! Meet Lord Sakai, also known as the Ghost. One of you explain what's happening, now. Kenji set me up is what's happening. It wasn't a setup. The Mongols were supposed to pay for this stuff. Only they didn't. And then, they took my friend Nato here hostage. They were supposed to pay for this? Hear that? They're back! Please, cut me loose! Oh, oh man. We stole them from Straw Hats. Oh. Lord Sakai, can you distract the Mongols? So you can escape? Not exactly. I have an idea. Trust me. No more ideas, Kenji. Just take your friend and go. God, Kenji. I had a feeling there was something... It wasn't just gonna be as easy as going to this camp and getting supplies. Oh! There is a lot of them out there, Kenji. Are you leaving me by myself? Alright, well. Alright. I hear an archer. There is a bear somewhere. Wait, will the bear help me though? Or is it one of those war bears or something? Whoop. Oh no, it is helping me. I see them over there. The straw hats are here too? Are they helping me? Hey, listen, man. He betrayed me, not. I didn't betray him. Oh, well, I'm attacking the straw hats too, so I'm guessing they're my enemy as well. Oh, I'm gonna help this guy out. We were once friends. Oh yeah, there we go. Look at that horse over there, just looking at the view. All this battle's going on. 
Oh, I need to change stances. Ooh. Boom. Bam. Boom. Plop. Missed that one. Alright, and there's an archer somewhere. There he is. <laughs> How are you guys shooting these arrows so fast? It must not be very accurate. Let me try it. Yeah, definitely not. Get out of here. Get off my... Get off my rock. Who do you think you is? Wait. Ow. Come on, man. Uh. Wow. That was insanely far. Kenji! Kenji's friend! You can come out now. Ken it's safe. Kenji's friend! We are locked in! How? How did you guys... We thought it would be safer in here, but then it locked. <laughs> That'd be funny if there's an alternate ending where you just leave them here. You dang, you dang dummies. Thank you, Lord Sakai. Yes, thank you. You know what happens now. <laughs> I'm going to ride that Sakai barrel all the way to... Kenji, I think he's angry. Lord Sakai. Our intention was always to gift our gains to the survivors who need it most. The camp outside the town of Yarikawa. Uh, gather everything you can. And when I visit that camp, I'm going to find it overflowing with food and medicine, correct? Yes, my lord. Yes, my lord. Yeah, better be. Look at me, I'm crossing my arms in anger. No, not even anger, I'm disappointed. This is just disappointment. <gasps> the Shadow Samurai. Dang. Let's see what we're gonna learn next. Um. So this one's more of like a quicker one. I think this one does damage. This one right here seems to do damage. This one right here seems to just stagger them. I feel like... No, y'all get the sticky bomb. Tar on a packet of black powder. It'll stick to anyone I throw it on. No escaping the blast. Oh, nice. And we have an extra point to uh, throw it. Let's see... Smoke bombs, temporary blind enemies caught in their blasts. Oh my god. Why don't I ever use these? Wait. Okay, I do sort of need that. Hmm. You can slow down time by 30% eventually. Oh, this is a difficult one. You know what? Let's get this one. I feel like this is the most useful. This is more of just me being stupid and uh, jumping from heights that I over or underestimate. Hurt Jin's uh, Legos. Charm advantage. Ghost uh, weapons deal 20 more damage. What do I have so far? Hmm. I think I'll keep the that one for now let's see let's do this one okay and i even had one one left and i didn't use it ever no i'll, I'll do 20 20 percent is pretty high i'd say Just checking everything else uh, oh, we got a mask. I kind of don't... I feel like you have to have a very specific outfit to go with these masks. So, maybe once I find that, then I'll use a mask. What's bad? It worked out perfectly. You call this perfect? The Mongols are dead, the Straw Hats are dead, and we have what we want. I mean, the survivors camped outside Yadikawa have what they want. What a quick conversation. And I guess you're just leaving. 
Nobu, did you see that? Dang Kenji. He didn't really set me up, but that was... That was... That was a lot more than just a camp that was uh, left alone. Let's go. Still really cool to see like that battle between the Straw Hats and the Mongols, though. Enter... Oh. I just got photobombed by the bird. He's probably laughing right now. Did he go tell his bird friends after this? She's like... Dude, I just I just photobombed Jin Sakai. They're like, really? No way. Um okay, I see a rock climb. So I'm guessing that's where I'm headed. Right, Mr. Bird? Or Mrs. Bird? Or bird. I'm hopping, I'm hopping, I'm hopping. Is that a Is that a person? That is a person. Is it a friend or foe? I guess I'll have to find out. Okay, well, I missed. I guess we'll see when we get up there. Maybe we won't because I don't really know. Maybe I can grapple onto his bald head. Well, I lost a bird. Oh, wait, right here. I need to be a little bit more attentive. Oh no, this is a friend. Oh man, this place looks. This place looks like it's taking some hits. Oh, is this the village that, or the camp that Sai was talking about? I just call him Sai. I didn't mean to call him that. Hmm, is that a bird on the floor? Oh no, it's like a turkey. Oh no, I'm supposed to go over here. Why do you seem so much bigger? Are these your friends? I doesn't seem like I can talk to anyone. Okay. Well, I'm glad I missed that arrow on this guy over here because uh, I'm not completely sure if you can do friendly fire, but I guess I would have found out then, huh? Alright, let's go to our next objective. That's my Nobu. Nobu is... Uh, top three characters in this game. Nobu is definitely number... Number one, pretty much. Best animals. Then it's probably like... I can't freaking choose between Eno and uh, the bird. Can't do that. They're both my best friends. With me throughout the whole game, just like Nobu. Where are these people outside the town walls? The Mongols have surrounded Yarikawa. No one can get in. Recruiting Lord Shimura's old rivals was never going to be easy. But now... Now they need allies too. Think about it. We help them drive off the Mongols. And they help us. I need their word before I fight for them. And we can't even get into the city. Yes, we can. There's a hidden entrance. From when we were children. Even if it's still there, we can't reach it. It's worth a try. I know a place we can scout for a way around the Mongol siege. I wonder what uh, Taka and uh, Yuna look like when they're younger. They probably got into from some pretty interesting stuff. It's strange being back after so many years. Everywhere I look, back memories and try not to look so hard were you here when the Yadikawa rebellion broke out no we left years earlier when we were children did your parents move you something like that that doesn't sound good oh They're heading for town let them pass that is a lot Clear. Dang it. Wow. That arrow went not at all where I thought it would go. There's not a lot of drop in this game, I guess. Not a lot of arrow drop. I don't want to see this. You've seen worse. But this was home. Sooner or later, everyone has to return home and confront their past. Our home. Surrounded by the enemy. Yarikawa 
doesn't stand a chance. You know, where's the hidden entrance? See that river near the town walls? Get us that far, and I'll do the rest. We can't sneak past an army. And even if we find an entrance, what if the Mongols see us? We'll sentence the town to death. Taka, I stake my life on your metalwork. Now it's your turn to trust me. Yes, my lord. I don't see how we can make it to the river. We'll find a way. We'll take the fight to the Mongols. Draw them off. Please, no. Taka's right. Too risky. I mean, to be fair, yeah. Uh, Sakai really is using the grappling hooks on some very Watch treacherous places. The Mongols out. Azamo Bay fell. Yarikawa will too. I know these people. They'll choose death before slavery. Oh, so they're, they're defend. The hidden entrance used to be over there, behind that white tree. Let's hope the Mongols haven't found it. We just have to find a way through the camp. Once we reach the water, it should be easy to find the entrance without being spotted. That's our plan? Sneak through the biggest Mongol camp I've ever seen? Then hope the secret entrance we used as children is still there? Stay close, Taka. Count on it. Let's go. I can't believe I'm risking my life coming back to this dump. This was your idea. You need to prove my worth to your uncle. Earn us passage off this island. I loved it here. You were too young to know how it really was. There you go was an ugly place for a girl without a handful of rice to her name. Is that why you left? I got us in trouble. It wasn't your fault. Uh... Are you sure this is a good idea? Are you ready to run? I was a little too focused on the conversation and I didn't realize how close I was getting to the enemy. One chime. Uh oh. Seems like there's not as many enemies over here. Yep, just one guy strolling around, having the days, having the time of his life. Look at that walk. Look at that strut. It's alright, Taka. Listen, I'll save you. Shimura Samurai, and Shimura always lost. Interesting choice. Dang. He was afraid to say that because he didn't want to hurt my feelings. But you didn't even care. Alright, I think I'm supposed to go this way. Whoop. You just gotta put little samurai... Little samurai helmets on the dragonflies. Craft one up, put on one of the, put them on both of the samurais, and uh, I mean, put them on both of the dragonflies, dragonflies and samurais, dragonfly samurai. <gasps> that sounds like a weird show. Patent pending. Probably why they've held out this long. When we get up there, let me do the talking. It's your hometown. Yeah, of course. I would. Wow. All right, Taka. Who are Rude. You? How did you get in? My brother and I were born here. Did the Mongols see you? No, but we're here to help you break their siege. First, tell me the name of the dead samurai you stole your gear from. He's not a thief. He's the ghost. The ghost. Of Tsushima? I'll take you to Ujimasa. But mind your step. We're all armed here. So run and tell the steward. Right away! Ujimasa. That was the name of Lord Yarikawa's youngest son. But my uncle disbanded their clan when he defeated them. The family still runs things here. Unofficial. Your uncle put down a rebellion and created a generation of people who hate Clan Shimura. The Mongols are crossing the bridge! You three, follow me and stay close. What's going on? A disturbance at the main gate. That can't be good. It's their leader! Are they going to attack? Let's find out what they want. The leader? The Khan? Anmar Min, oh. people of Yarikawa. I am Shemuke, leader of this war band. I learned your speech, so I may offer you a future. 
Open your gates before my camp flies the black flag. And you will know great mercy. Refuse, and you will know terrible misery. Choose your future, Yarikawa. They're leaving. Let's go. If Yarikawa surrenders, Lord Shimura won't get his army. Don't worry. They're too stubborn to surrender. If they don't, it will be a bloodbath. They need my uncle as much as he needs them. United, we can beat back the invaders. People here have bad memories of Lord Shimura. If they're going to survive, Yarikawa needs to let go of the past. Easier said than done. Ojimasa knows you here. You two go ahead. I want to check on the swordsmith. Lord Sakai. Ujimasa Yarikawa. I never thought Lord Shimura's nephew would be responsible for the ghost. You best be careful, or he'll punish you. As he punished my once great family for inciting rebellion against your Jito. That was years ago. We've all got bigger problems now. Who's this? Your servant? I was born here. Yet you're aiding Clan Shimura. No, I'm fighting for Lord Sakai. For the ghost. We can help break the siege outside your walls. In return, Lord Shimura requests your help. The Mongols want to conquer the mainland. They will lose interest in us. And Yarikawa will survive. Like we always do. That could have gone better. Let's find Taka. Ujimasa is a fool. You can be convinced. The whole island's burning, and Yarikawa is next. If that doesn't convince him, nothing will. Taka used to visit this swordsmith every day. If there was any leftover metal, he let my brother pretend to make swords. Oh, <gasps> so this was this was like Taka's mentor before like Taka was like, uh, like a, like a smither himself. Already though, um, seems like a good place to end the episode. Just right before whatever is uh, gonna be happening in the next part. See if we're gonna. Had to fight this huge siege of a lot of Mongols. A little scary, but uh, nothing uh, Yuna and uh, Jin and Taka can't handle. And of course Nobu. But I can't call him right now though. So, I uh, hope you guys all enjoyed. Thank you all for watching. And uh, see you all in the next episode. Goodbye.